to the East Bay and now a, a heartfelt farewell for 23-month-old uh, th rather Jasper Wu. The little toddler was hit and killed by a stray bullet in Oakland nearly two weeks ago. Just a heart-wrenching story, and the shooting happened while he was caught in the crossfire of a gang-related gunfight on 880. According to police, his mother was behind the wheel as they were driving to their home in Fremont. Crown Force Philippe de Gaulle shares how Jasper is being remembered. 23-month-old Jasper Wu mourned by family and friends at Mountain View Cemetery in Oakland. Following Chinese tradition, after the funeral, loved ones gathered out front, burning some of Jasper's toys and other items that made him happy, with the belief the flame will deliver his belongings up in heaven. Family just could stop crying. The traditional Buddhist ceremony ended with Jasper's cremation. President of the Oakland Chinatown Chamber of Commerce, Carl Chan, speaks for the Wu family. He recalls part of Jasper's grandfather's speech detailing how much harm has been done by one senseless act. The bullet not only hitting little Jasper, but also, also hitting him as a grandpa, but basically to the entire community. It has been nearly two weeks since Jasper was hit and killed by a stray bullet in Oakland while he was caught in the crossfire of a gang-related gunfight along Interstate 880. His family was headed home that day to Fremont. It's just unnecessary violence, unprovoked violence that's impacting our communities leads to this pain. Oakland Police Chief Leron Armstrong says his department is working with the California Highway Patrol in its investigation, but at this time, there are no suspects. It's more about people making better decisions. It's about people not taking these type of actions in our community that cause such tragedy. I think that's the real statement here. Chief Armstrong says he would support adding cameras on freeways to assist in investigations Meanwhile, the Oakland Chinatown Chamber of Commerce says it hopes to increase its $10,000 reward for information that will help solve this case in the coming weeks. In Oakland, Philippe Jagal, Cron 4 News.